Greetings gamers, this is Jared Leopold getting ready for his second uh, game for the Ashcon 4. Now we're on 4 already, which is awesome. Uh, this is for the card game uh, Ashes Reborn. I'm going to be playing uh, someone that I haven't played before, Alice, I believe. Uh, I know they're in Australia, and so I think it's right around noon. Uh, their time it's about 9 p.m mine here in central <laughs> um so yeah i've been lucky enough to play people from all around the world after this game that's really it's one of the neat things about this tournament is that it's really all-encompassing and inviting for everyone to come in and play that's one of the really nice things about it uh i am here we can get my deck out here oops Just want to get this out of the way too. Want to thank you, Ashes Live. Also, as all the games are taking place on AshTechie.com. Um, none of this stuff could happen without the work of this community. It is fairly bonkers that people are doing this uh, for free. All right, so I put together. Uh, Noah deck for Serve the Doll. <laughs> uh, I really wanted to see what I could do with Serve the City. In the initial super jank build, which I wish I had kept together, was Serve the City combined with Living Doll. Um, so you can main action, Serve the City, side action, throw the damage directly onto the opponent's Phoenix Born. For no dice. Doesn't cost anything to do that. It just cost the die to get the book down. Um, which I do think is probably a pretty legit finisher. Um, but I got... Uh, I started... I played like one or two games with this. And then I started getting more and more aggressive with my builds on it. I've never really gotten to play with Darkwater Hunter. In a deck that I thought was really good. Um, Serve the City with Darkwater Hunter takes care of knights, takes care of phoenix, it does great. Uh, the same is said for ruined dwellers as well. Got that 3-2. Uh, wave crashes is for your bypass and for your direct damage on there. So this is all contributing to your reach. Uh, Owenbringer is just a little bit of more disruption in your deck, along with running just know his ability of shadow target uh the one of the cards that i'm not running that i really miss is memory theft with noah but that's something i'll just have to maybe try and figure out in future iterations and then let's see now what else first we've got a couple fate reflections that honestly have been completely useless in the couple games i've gotten to play with this there's really no reason to be running this um i the same with Sleeping Widows. Those are four cards that I could free up right now. Um, if you change those into Final Cries or Sympathy Pains, this deck goes from, hey, this is pretty good, to it's winning. It's going to be winning a lot of the games. Between your standstill, your side action stuff, to clear the way for your attacks, um, it's a very aggressive deck. You're doing damage in batches with Pact being everywhere out there. You need a way to handle it and also by taking out the four life peeps. Oh, yeah. Okay, the game must have fallen down. Oh, let me check. Oh, it's still there. Here, is this it? Hmm. Maybe it's not showing up for them. Okay. Uh, try another one. 
All right, so we're gonna go. Leave, there we go. All right, let's try a new game. There we go, show hands. I think the time limit, I believe, is unofficially 70 on there. Perfect. Right on. <laughs> oh, oh, that. Oh, boy. Good luck and have fun. You have any questions? Yeah, I'm just going to go with my basic start. I haven't played this deck enough to do alternate first fives yet. <laughs> The first five draws one card to their next by five. What? Oh no. <laughs> well, that works out. Drew into Fate Reflection. Didn't know you could do that. You can just start a lower. Th <laughs> That's amazing. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, no problem. Yeah, okay. All right, so I can, I'm a little off my game here. Started four books, then just hit start. So I didn't even throw, throw in my Shadow Blade, which you pretty much always want to start with. However, changing up for a first five with Fate Reflection, nothing wrong with that. However, that means I'm going to strand a couple of dice unless sequencing goes amazing for me and they can go first discard any cards nope that's another thing that i like about this deck too very few uh power sides just don't really need them this is great oh, i miss that memory theft right now uh, let's take a peek. Know what I know what I want to uh, exhaust with the shadow target. All right, here we go. Odette starting off strong with the butterfly monk. We're going to let's go throw a book out there. Meditate one. Confirm. It's always. It's always the wave crash. <laughs> All right, what are we guessing here? Uh, butterfly monk, bear, transfusion? Butterfly monk beats bears. That'd be my guess. Okay. Um, Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna throw out the time hopper book. And then do I shut down bear? Yeah, just because I don't know what else it would be. Right? So bloop. Bloop. Uh, Winged Lioness with Odette is fantastic. Um, I 
As far as the ninth, what could be? What could we be looking at? One, two, three. Oh, I needed that extra, t that other time die. Oh, Jared, I'm already messing it up. Old salt. Let's see, is this an Odette with the chain, with Pact in there? Could be. Throw this out. It is champ. Do the bottom. Nature's wrath. To the top. Okay, so ritualist. Champ. Kind of open. Use the ability. Fate reflection back into him. Yeah, I miss sequence of my dice on here. Uh, there's a possibility I could have played two. Uh, two ruin dwellers. Still is, technically. All right, Hammer Knight. Giant. Okay. Got Ruin Dweller. See if we can try and salvage this mess here by playing, getting Ruin Dweller out. What are we looking here? Passes their main. Well, that's good for me. And I still might be able to do it. Service City is looking pretty good here. Hmm. Yep, I'll take that three damage to a dead every time. Try and attack that butterfly monk. Boy, that was best case scenario there. All right, Noah. <laughs> You ready to jump in front of a charging hammer knight? No. No, I hear you. I hear you screaming, Cheetah.
There's the ritualist. Grabs another treant. Okay, let's take out the monk. And then we can play Ruin Dweller, tank it, take out the knight. Just imagine how much better that would be with a Shadow Blade there. <laughs> Uh, whoopsies. Now, Fate Reflection is going to be really good going into round two, so I, I cannot be upset about that. And I was able to still get the sequencing of the two, two Rune Dwellers. Two chants. Yep. Done. Got it. Man, if my opponent had enough force for sight to spin up this into a frog pain, I wouldn't even be able to take out the knight here. But thankfully, I'm going to be able to. There's no reason you don't attack with a knight. Yep. Yeah, there's the frog side too late. So we're looking at all right, serve the city, Rune Dweller, take out Hammer Knight. Loads up the two chants, but it's worth it to clear up the battlefield for that. Not going to be able to use the chants this round. Um, so, I mean, that, that's one way to get rid of its um, utility, I guess. Have all your units be toast. <laughs> and, all right, gonna, can take out the time hopper here if, if they want with the frog ping. Probably not worth it. Probably not worth meditating to get to get it. All right, passes their turn. Yeah, couldn't be happier. I don't have any need for a power side, so that's fine. Okay, I got my one power side. I got some sleeping widows. I got a standstill. Got my living doll. And a dark water hunter. Okay. Let's do this. Let's, can we slow roll this? Maybe. Because we know they've got Okay, I gotta, I gotta remove our swords out there too. Okay, old salt to the bottom, call on the top.
Mm, I should probably remember that I have Noah and shut down that bear. Burp. Oh, I gotta focus up. They've got a lot of access to allies here, <laughs> and probably a bunch more allies in their hand. Hmm. Like, how much do we want to head for here? Yep. Okay, so we know they've got Nature's Wrath, so we can't... Widows. Bear is pretty interesting. We could break it right now. What if we play the Rune Dweller? Let's see what happens here. Do we draw out a sword? Shut down a butterfly monk, that's what I'm thinking we do. I want to get Living Doll out there so bad. Let's go with just Rune Dweller. I think we pass. Yeah, we pass on the Widows. We need to figure out a time to spin up the time die, which we should have a bit ago. Yeah, I've spent five dice already. Ugh. Hmm, yep, this seems pretty fun. Take it to the bear, fate reflection. But it still takes the two damage. Now I gotta scramble. Can chant the hopper. Yeah, I forgot about that, didn't I? Meteor? Oh, that'd be something. <laughs> I've spent so much dice, I just gotta take it easy. One problem with doing damage in batches is that you're also spinning through your dice pretty quickly. Okay. Hanks it. That's cool. Mm. 
can annotate. I like that what else is ever going to happen, but it might. Presumably, we've got an ally in hand, right? Okay, what do we got here? Exhausted Time Hopper, Woman Bringer, Ruin Dweller, just hanging out. I still got the Time Hopper book and the Serve the City book. Unexhausted, we got a Ritualist and a Frostback Bear with 2 damage on it. Got two train of transfusion books loaded, so definitely needs to use the like use both books, right? I don't. My biggest problem with chain of transfusion is that it is either or main action or side action. If you have it just be one of those, I think it's fixed. <laughs> As it is, I think it's too much. Because <clears throat> right now, uh, they can wipe out one of my units and heal theirs for zero dice. Like, I understand wanting to make a powerful engine. Yeah, here it goes. Here's the first one. Omen Bringer going down. Oh, no. Huh. Do they not know? Or are they trying to get the time hopper out so they can do the Boy, I don't know what's going on here. Living doll. I want to get the living doll out there so bad. <laughs> I think I just have to wait on the living doll. A second, living doll, dark water hunter. That's what I'll spend my dice on. So, Gak and the bear seems okay, right? Yeah, that's fine. Whatever. Hmm. Takes away the access to the other wound tokens that's out there, but with eight dice. There's so much eight dice and a mid full of cards like the something something world is their oyster or something something. So it uh yeah. It'd be amazing if they just had Just like a knight and a bunch of cards that didn't do anything. <laughs> but I have a hard time believing that, especially when he's got goat heads, uh, just to pull stuff back. Do it. Do it. Play the nature's wrath. Become wrath. And here's the attendant. Hmm. 
Think me. <laughs> well, I guess anything I can do here. Take out the ritualist, I guess. Hmm. Just gotta weed out the damage somehow. Let's get the living doll out there. Yeah, finally. Finally. I've never gotten the living doll in play, so this is a little exciting for me. Mm -mm. Kill one, kill the ruined dweller. Well, that was fun. <laughs> All right, it's not even just pass. Yep, I just try and blast it out now. That you spun up. To lion heads for some reason. No, not the time up. Oh no, I don't care. Pass. Not gonna do nature's wrath today, huh? Hmm. That's interesting. So I got the living doll out there. That one wound on their Phoenix attendant is gonna be interesting. I'm hoping they grab a hammer knight. Swing. I'll tank the hit. Throw out the dark water hunter and get the attendant. Is the hope here, but we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Another Phoenix attendant. Interesting. Okay. Well, I'm not quite sure what you want me to do. They're getting their heel on. I'm going to do my tricky. I serve the city. To remember that I needed to wait. I do. Oh boy, I forgot to do it. That's the other reason I put this together. So, you living doll that damage as a sign action, drop in the dark water hunter, take out one of their big guys. Hashtag oops. Surely they have sword. All right. 
Hydra. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> That's all right. Well, Hydra with uh, one life. So what do we do here? We get the hunter. Grass. We need to make it safe for the hunter. I don't need that, but so we got two active Phoenix attendants. <laughs> yeah. How many people are we attacking with here? <laughs> Thankfully for me, anyway. Put one on me. All right, now we put Hunter out. Boom. Send it now. And then no to the rescue <laughs> from the one <laughs> shiny hydra. All right, everybody. Let's clear those uh, clear those wound tokens, shall we? <laughs> I think the only way I stay in this game here. E well, Shadow Blood will help, but I really... Oh, my frog pings. I, uh... Oh, boy. <laughs> I didn't even look at my dice yet. That is a lot of time basics. Okay. All right, let's take a look here. Ritualist, Attendant, Hydra on my opponent's side. I've got Living Doll and Darkwater Hunter. Okay. Life totals are even at 14. They've got some frog pings up and an active Odette. They don't know this, but I did not draw another Fate Reflection. I finally got a shadow blade, but I don't think that's going to do anything. Well, that's a lie. That does everything. There's the nature's wrath. He doesn't know if I'm going to kill this hydra right now. Yeah. 
in what I meant to say when I said I'm going to kill this Hydra right now. I meant to say that he was going to kill my Dark Water Hunter with Chant. So what? Oh, the Chant was already loaded. Mm. Okay. Become Wrath. On the plus side, so is the Living Doll. But that takes up some uh, things here. Uh, I need dice before I can do anything. Even with the Adept Duelist, Dark Water Hunter. Boy, I gotta meditate a bunch. Like so much. And there goes a flash strike. There goes my other flash strike. I might as well go three for three. And another dark water hunter. Alright, well there's all my blue urns. So didn't have a chance to hit their you know, that was probably I could have blanked their I don't know, exhaust their air. I still could have played something. I don't know. But they still have a chance, so all my two life stuff is not great. I could just pass. That is interesting. Is it interesting? Not really. Attack the living doll? No. I'm just going to pass. Pass my main action. I think I might have panicked a little bit there. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> the living doll being within. Yeah, I had so many side actions I needed to do there. I needed to get the wound off the living doll. I needed to shadow target the frost back there. I needed to meditate. So. Alright, there's Butterfly Monk. So, can still hit the Frost back there. Oh, Pain Nature's Wrath, so you're all gone. That's good. Hmm, okay. Ant or bear, what do you think? Bear. Mm, it would be pretty funny if we just all passed here. I could play another living doll. Yeah, right now, if they passed, it would be pretty awesome from them. They're down on dice. All their books are exhausted except for one. All right, use this Hydra. Yep. Mm, that was the right move on their part. Yeah, so they just passed out. Do I want to discard any cards here? No. Okay. I feel pretty happy about this. Do I? I don't know. I feel fine. <laughs> Let's go, Omenbringer.
All right, does have meteors and festers, so we'll go fester can stay on the top. Meteor, I don't know. Do I care about meteor? It's not a chant. I'll put the meteor on top. Hmm. Okay, let's hit bear. All right. I wonder, I probably should just played the living doll, but I was so afraid of giving that hand away that he just gacked the other living doll. Well, just such an awkward turn of events there. I need Odette to take damage so I can throw the Dark Water Hunter out there. Okay, so Hydra's only got one. Okay. But the Odette wants to hit the Hydra, but if it does that, then I just Adept Duelist it. Oh, and lop off its head. Is the Adept Duelist wielding the old Snickersnack? Is the Hydra the Jabberwocky? Let's go. For all you mythology uh, nerds. Best case scenario, they Odette, Omen Lightbringer. I do the two, I throw down, throw down the hunter. Swing in. <gasps> it's happening. <gasps> Dark Winter Hunter. Five dice to their ten. Gross. <laughs> Hit for four, and I could also do other stuff here, but I won't. All right. High five. You did it. <laughs> You're only down. All of the dice. So I've never really gotten to play with a Dark Water Hunter in a deck before, in a dedicated deck like this before, and it's awesome. I'm not gonna lie, it's been so good. Now, granted, I've put some stuff together to make it feel better too, like Wave Crash. Living doll, classic living doll. Oh, they disconnected and they're back. Whoa, hey, Grave Knight. What do you know? You know, you're gonna gack a living doll.
Oh, should we just do that? Oh, I want to just gack it so bad. Spend all my dice. Yeah, fine. <laughs> So it lets them know. Hmm, mm, it's the fate reflection. All right, this is the part where the Odette just starts mashing my face off. Seven dice to my two. I've managed to clean the board up of all the big hitters. Um, my only hope is they just don't have any more hitters in their hand. Although they've got goat heads to bring people back from their back from the graves. Yeah, we. Here comes the healing train. I mean, Odette with Pact is a natural fit though, right? She uses a lot of her her ability to do damage to herself, so Pact helps her heal. Like, this is pretty legit. I'm gonna have to get rid of one of these standstills. I need cards in hand. Oh, I disconnected. I didn't even know it. The. <laughs> okay, more than one Hydra. Well, I think that probably means that end of turn I snapped the dark water back to my hand. On connectivity. Full swing? I 100% missed something there. It uses chant to move one damage from the Phoenix Attendant to. Oh, okay, so moved one over, then took it off with the Hydra. Oh, that's very clever. That's fun. Okay, um, like ping it again. Oh boy, that is frustrating. Let's go. Passing in action. There you go. Yeah, I can just make this shining hydra honking big. How big? Honking big. Uh. 
<clears throat> and still enough dice to make a hammer knight. Stupid hang on. All right, so I've got two turns. Oh boy, no faith. <laughs> Attack and living doll. Yeah, that's fine. I'm gonna counter though. <laughs> Here comes the raptor herders. Yeah, that should be it. It should be game right here. Ugh, fiddlesticks. Grabs the... That's right, I said fiddlesticks. Uh, <laughs> grabs the raptor herder, throws it down. Swing for a one, two, three, four, five. Pop around, swing for eight. You can see the 13 right there. Good game. I mean, I like the I like that the games are going a little bit longer for sure, right? Um, well, I have to I don't know I have to figure this out. Gotta get some better. Play sequencing. My sequencing was very off all night for sure. Um, oh, cool. Hit me for three there, too. That'll get you the same. And what I meant by the same is uh, five, not, not even close to being the same. Can I get three heads? Yeah, I can. Oh, neat. Four, five, six. Hmm. Go ahead and attack the monk. Yeah, great. Oh yeah, soak up the damage. Fantastic. Well, I'm going to see one more round then. We'll see what kind of burn plan. I don't see any burn so far. So that's cool. Makes me think they they just have to slow play it. Means I need to gack this Hydra. Immediately. Oh, yeah, Festers. Where are my Festers? Yeah, I gotta get rid of Standstill. Uh, both Standstills? Probably. Holy good dice, Jared. Thanks, Jared. Oh, holy good dice on their side, too. Let's go. Yeah, I think I have to. Hmm. Didn't get it. No festers for you. Were they just sitting on molten gold this whole time? We're going to find out. Hmm. 
Oh. Nope. That's a hundred percent negative. Ooh, third chant. Fun. Okay. Why my screen get so wonky? Uh, bear. <laughs> All right, we are in minute fifty five of the game. Soon, mm -hmm. assuming they've got the other sword in there, there's no reason not to do it. I haven't shown. Anything. My discard's certainly not showing anything. Yeah. Yeah. No, there's nothing I can do here. So get some blood points, huh? Let's see what we can do. I guess I needed uh guess I needed that standstill for a blood point. <laughs> uh, lame. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I needed to play the Dark Water Hunter. But then I just get swords, but at least it can get me through. Boom. 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 Take that, monk. Hmm. Ba, ba, ba. Second Hydra. Didn't see it coming. All right. And well played. <laughs> yeah, that was a, that was a very good game. Uh, There's a lot of control. Uh, so the Odette get the dice advantage in round three. And uh, yeah, it took me out. Oh, that was a great game. Thanks so much for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you find it interesting, please join us over at the Discord on Ashes. Um, so, yeah, thanks a lot. Have a great day. Bye.